shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the window. Alright dude, thanks for stopping by, appreciate it. Good night bro. Get rid of fucking stick. Oh, another decision already? Alright, I already know the decision I'm fucking making. Bye, dog. Bitches, bitches. Wait, take the screwdriver. Wait, really? <laughs> Fuck. Oh, we're skipping all of that, dude. I can't. Oh, triggered. All right, that's fine. Oh, there's really no way to skip this cutscene. God damn it, I'm triggered.
why not like use your other leg and stomp his arm out? Alright. Yeet. Right in the mouth, right in the head. I love it. Um nom nom nom. I thought you said he was gonna honk. Why can't I take the screwdriver out of its head? I feel like it's like the first thing I would do in real life. Oh. Nice guy, Kenny, dude. Nice guy, Kenny, dude. Came back from my buns when I needed it most. I think I need to go. To Atlanta? Yeah. I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Sounds like nobody knows what's happening here. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. had to rub a cramp out of my neck. That shit hurt. You gotta do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. Ace Pizza. Hey kid, close call back there. Thanks for picking me up. No problem. We have to take care of each other. Yeah, we do. I think you know what you're doing. Shit, man, do any of us? With Clementine, I mean. Earlier, you said you were clueless. I just want you to know that I look at you and I see the type of guy who figures things out. The girl's gonna be just fine. Thanks, Kenny. You got it. Okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It happened pretty fast. I know it's stupid. We just met. But he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Well, I'm sure he liked you, too. <laughs> he better have. 
Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. I'll stay. Wait. Hmm? What is it? Who did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. I was gonna help you both. But you helped me first. Yeah, I did. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carl. I don't. He's a fatty. Fatties would die. I would die in the fucking zombie apocalypse pretty quickly. I'm a fatty. JK, I'm a fucking god. <laughs> Super dinosaurs. Oh, and then? Hey, Doc, uh, you want to cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. Super dinosaur. Not my kids here. No, it's not that. It's. I got grabbed again. I was there, though. They fell, and my walkie talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. It's just a walkie talkie. It probably wasn't much use to begin with. It wasn't just a walkie-talkie. And I know it doesn't make any sense. But it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here. Hmm. Nigga, what the fuck? I'm gonna smack you in your forehead. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. Now you go near my daughter, or step on a line once, or so you are the eyes. I know who you are, and I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. I'll fucking drop you, you fucking broke ass, fucking hard ass, bitch ass, some little bitch, little small dick ass, old ass, bitch ass nigga. <laughs> dad would be dead if it weren't for you. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. Fine. We're lucky to have you. That's the sound of us winning this thing. Me too. This motor in's pretty damn defendable. If we block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch, we could stay here until the military rolls through. I actually agree with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. There are worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. It's not gonna be okay. You're all gonna die. Next time on the Walking Dead. Oh, hey, they didn't die. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling lonely. <laughs> no man, you're my job. Ain't John Barry. I never did thank you for saving Doc from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the fans. Who's that guy? He swallows an arrow. No, it is. 